Hi, we are going to add a MacBook Air to Windows domain. So I'm going to this one, reference, use and group, then uh, unlock your login option. So select login option, then join, then type your domain name. So type your Windows domain username password. So I think there is a problem. So we have to go to the uh, DC Windows domain controller, then uh, you can uh, <coughs> add new PC so type your MacBook Air PC name there so new computer then type your MacBook Air PC name right so say ok you can add the description so that's my third MacBook Air so I copy and uh, add to my new MacBook. Yes, right. So we create new computer account. So now let's go to the MacBook Air. Unlock. So again, type your domain name. Add username. So still we have same issue. So I think we have to restart. Right, go to the system preference, then check network. So if you configure your manual IP, that's a better static IP. So then go to join again. Right. So type your server name. Yeah, so again, now you can, you have to edit, secure, the open your direct utility, click domain name, open direct utility, so unlock active directory, select, then go to edit, then click enable root user, then type your admin password. Verify it right so then go to advanced option show advanced option then tick create mobile user account login okay so we did it and uh, now go back so now you can see the domain name then log out now you can log and check yes now you can see other using so I type my username Janit P yeah then there is a come there is a message so create new mobile account then if you want you can put your uh, Apple ID then if, it is, if you don't have then skip it and go there yeah done we successfully add Mac book air to Windows domain so thank you very much for watching this video.